In early 2011, I was just a year into being a freelance social media manager. I was having a lot of traction with managing local small businesses, social media accounts, and my biggest struggle was being able to schedule content for clients to Facebook and Twitter. I reached out to my dad, a very savvy and seasoned programmer, and asked if he could write a simple piece of software that would allow for me to schedule out my posts. A short while later, he responded with just use this and included a link to Sendable. I was in awe of this software that would not only allow for me to schedule posts to Facebook and Twitter, but so much more. The more I poked around, the more I knew I had a major upgrade to my business. Now paying for a scheduling platform was a big commitment to me back in the day, but it ultimately allowed for me to level up services, increase my customer base and other business needs that I had. Even as more and more competitors came out over the years, Sendable has stayed consistent in quality, customer service and cutting edge solutions in an ever changing social media world, making them the only tool I will use for social media management. I share this with you fellow agency owners and members so you can understand my deep love for this tool and company and to share with you how my agency has used Sendable to manage hundreds of clients over the last decade. By the way, my name is Desiree Martinez. and I will be your guide through all things social media management. Make sure to hit that subscribe button down below if you are with an agency wanting to streamline your social media management workflow and stay up to date with tips and trends in social media marketing. My ultimate favorite, the compose box and bulk upload. My agency agency focuses on generating a month of content at a time for customers. We connect with our customers on a monthly basis about the previous month's analytics, what performed well, current trends, and any objectives and initiatives they have. Then in a Google spreadsheet, we write messaging, organize links, and plan images and videos. Since my agency launched in 2015, this is how it's always been. The messaging, formatting, and media has definitely changed. But the planning, that is the foundation that we do not want to crack. Now I share this because my all time favorite feature, which is the reason I came to Sendable, is the compose box. Now this interface has changed over the years, but the name has stayed the same. I truly feel that the compose box is the lifeblood of the tool. This is where everything starts, selecting the platforms, sharing the message, loading links, images, and videos, scheduling, getting approvals, and posting all starts in the compose box. But my secret is the bulk upload feature. Like I mentioned, we generate a month of content at a time. So we need a fast and efficient way to upload the content to Sendable. We just work through the columns for our workflow. We copy all the content into the messaging spot. Then we set all the dates and times, paste necessary URLs, and then upload any images. If we have any videos, we will still upload the messaging and schedule it, and then add the post to include video when we review all of the scheduled posts to make sure dates are correct, media is there, and URLs have loaded in correctly. This is the way I upload my content and it works for me. However, you do have the option to simply upload a CSV to the tool without having to manually fill it in. Another feature I love and we use quite frequently is the image editing tool. Oftentimes the clients will give us an image that we need to share across multiple platforms. But as you know, each platform has different size requirements for images. So this tool makes it easy to crop, add text, stickers, or filter to an image. Sometimes you just need to add a little extra for an image to do well, and this tool helps. As you know, things happen. There are major cultural or social events that make posting inappropriate. The clients need changes when something more relevant and trendy pops up. These things tend to lead to a content calendar change. Sendable has made it super easy to change up content posting with the drag and drop feature in the calendar. I can easily just drag and drop content to a new place rather than having to manually change dates and times for when content is supposed to be published. Being able to shuffle content quickly when you are managing a lot of clients and social networks is vital to any agency. As my client list grew, so did my team, which meant I needed a way to add team members and assign accounts to them. There is really no need for every team member to have access to all the clients the agency manages. Once the social profiles are added to Sendable and organized into a list, I am able to assign profiles to users so they can start posting content and managing the client's content. As the master account manager, I am able to monitor all of the accounts to make sure everything is running smoothly and calendars are being managed correctly. While I don't use this feature myself, Sendable does give you the ability for your clients to have their own dashboards, which means that they can log into the tool and view their own content. 
After about the first year of my business, my clients started asking if this was working. Like most things in marketing, they wanted to make sure that they were paying for was actually worth it. That is where the reporting tab became a linchpin for the longevity with my customers. Being able to create a report to show them growth, engagement, top performing posts, audience demographics, and more allowed them to understand the value of what they were paying for. And from an agency perspective, it's so easy to generate and customize. You just select the social network, the account that wants the report and generate the report. It's very simple. There's even a cheat sheet option so that you can send it to your customer that explains what each part of the report is so you can cut back on email explanations or longer than desired meetings. Our team uses this internally to track what is and isn't working for the client. We're able to see what did or didn't perform well, make back-end adjustments like times that our postings are done, and have team conversations about areas of improvement and potential post ideas. And while this might seem tiny, it is a huge lifesaver. I love the notifications feature. Now remember, I have been doing this for over a decade and there wasn't always a way of knowing when something was wrong with my accounts. There's usually a slew of issues that could arise. API requirement changes for reconnecting accounts or big social networks make a big update or clients change their passwords without telling me. All these things could happen in the past. I wouldn't know about it until we would see that content was not posting and then it was a matter of troubleshooting. With the notifications feature, I was able to know exactly what needs to be fixed. It streamlines the problem so much and allows for seamless management and clients to not experience any issues. Now that you know how I use Sendable for social media management, watch this video here so I can show you how to effectively onboard new clients to your agency. And watch this video here because YouTube thinks you are really going to like it. And remember, until next time, keep it simple.